Tell me, or I'll- No, not the buttons! Not my gumdrop buttons! All right then. Hey, what's up? It's William from Rocket Zero, and welcome to another Pixel Art tutorial. In this video, we're gonna be building not the gumdrop buttons. Little Gingerbread Man from the movie Shrek. Now, I absolutely love that movie. It's probably my favorite movie that I watched growing up. So we're gonna be using some black, some brown, some pink, some red, and then just some white wool for his eyes. Now, before we get started, please make sure to hit that like button down below. Subscribe if you haven't. Go ahead and click the notification bell so you can be notified when we post a new video. And now, let's get started. All right, so we're gonna begin this pit slot by placing just two blocks of whatever wool you want because we need to build two blocks up so that this is what we're gonna start our build from. So we're gonna grab our black wool and then we're gonna place five black wools. So make sure you guys have those five black wools levitating in the air, but it needs to be two blocks high. Then we're gonna place one black wool on the right, skip a block, one black wool in the middle, skip a block, and one black wool on the top. Now that's the letter E, but we need it to be B. So this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna place one block here and here. And that's how you build the letter B. Now we're gonna skip three blocks. So one, two, three. We're gonna place a black. And then on each side, you're gonna go up by four black wools. So one, two, three, four. And then on the right, we're gonna go one, two, three, four. And that's how you build the U, because we're building the letter buttons, or not the letters, but the word buttons. So now we're gonna go up here, we're gonna place one white wool, and then three black wools. And then in the middle here, we're gonna go down by four. One, two, three, and four, and that's gonna be the T. Now we need another T, so we're gonna place one white wool, and then three black wools. And then in the middle of those three blacks, we're gonna go down by four black wool. So here we have butt and we need to add the O and S for buttons. Now we're gonna grab our white wool and we're gonna place you know two white wools and a black. Let's take out those two white wools and then on the left side we're gonna go down by three black wools and on the right we're also gonna go down by three black wools and then we need one in the middle. And that's gonna be the O so we have butter now, for buttons, we need to add an N and S. Now, every so often, after you build something, I'm gonna be taking a step back, allowing you guys to have an opportunity to hit pause, just in case you need a little bit of extra building time, or you know, whatever. Just hit pause whenever you want. So now let's grab this white wool. We're gonna go down here. We're gonna place just two white wools, and then to the right of this white wool, we're gonna go up by five black wools. So one, two, three, four, five. Then we're gonna move to the right and the second block from the top, we're gonna place a black wool. Then we're gonna place another diagonal. And to the right of this diagonal, we need to place another five black wool. So we're gonna go one, go below, two, three, go back to the top, four and five. And that's how you make an N. So now we have button. Now we need an S because there's more than one button. So we're gonna place one white wool down here. And then we're gonna place three black wools going to the right. Then one diagonal going to the right. Two black wools going to the left. One diagonal going to the left. Then we're gonna have three black wools going to the right. And there we go. So make sure you guys have this so far. Pause it if you need to. And that's how you build buttons. So let's get it in frame. Make sure you guys have this so far. Pause it if you need to. Now let's go ahead and build the gingerbread man and then we're gonna do the the gumdrop buttons or not the gun, gun, bleh, gumdrop, there you go, that's how you say it, okay. So now let's go ahead and build the little gingerbread man. So we're gonna place just three blocks going to the right from the S and then below the third block right here, we're gonna go down by six. So one, two, three, four, five, and can we get there? Six. Let's go ahead and get rid of that. So here we have a row of sits, black wools going up. Then we're gonna have two diagonals going up and to the right. Then we're gonna have twist, 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 twist shape. Then we're gonna have one diagonal going up and to the left. And then we're gonna go up by sits on the left side. So one, two, three, four, five, and six. So awesome. Make sure you guys have this so far. Pause it if you need to. 
Next, we're gonna have two diagonal black wools going up and to the right. Then we're gonna have six black wools going to the right, so we have one, two, three, four, five, and six. Then we're gonna have two diagonal black wools going down and to the right. Then we're gonna go down by six black wools on the right, so one, two, three, four, five, and six. Then we're gonna have one diagonal going to the left. Then we're gonna place three black wools in this funky little shape. Now we're gonna have two diagonal black wools going down and to the right. And then we're gonna go straight down by sits. So we have one, two, three, four, five, and six. And that's gonna be the outline of our gingerbread man. Now we're gonna go back to the bottom. We're gonna skip two blocks. And then on the third block, we're gonna go up by five. One, two, three, four, and five. Now let's go to the right here. We're gonna skip two blocks and then we're gonna go up by five. One, two, three, four, five. Now we need to find the middle here. So one, two, and then three, four. So on this third and fourth block in the middle here, we're just gonna place two brown wools and then we're gonna place a cube out of four pink wools. Then another two brown wools and a cube out of four pink wools. Make sure you guys have this so far, pause it if you need to. At the end of the video, we're gonna go ahead and fill in our little gingerbread man, but for now, we're not gonna worry about it. What we're gonna worry about is that we're gonna go to this diagonal right here and above it, we're gonna place three brown wools going to the right. Then we are gonna grab our red wool and we're gonna place four red wools going to the right. And a diagonal red wool on each side, just like that. Then we're gonna grab our brown wool and we're gonna place three brown wools above each of those two diagonal red wools. Then we're gonna grab our white. We're gonna place a white wool to the right here and on the left here. Then we're gonna grab our pink. We're gonna place one pink wool on the left of this brown wool. And then above it, we're gonna place two going to the right. Then we're gonna place one on the right here. And above it, we're gonna place two going to the left. And in the end, we're just gonna go ahead and fill them in with some brown wool. But now we need to get back to the letters. Because what makes this pizza so special is that it's a quote from the movie Shrek. Like, not the gum drop buttons. So that's what we're doing. All right, so let's get over here. Let's get back to work. We're just gonna place one block right here to space it out. So place that one block there above the B. Then you're gonna place two black wools going to the right. Then you're gonna add three black wools in this shape. We're gonna take out that spacing block and on the left side, we're gonna go ahead and place three black wools and then two black wools going to the right. So you're left with the G. I will pause it here in case you need a little bit of extra time. Now we're gonna place two spacing blocks going to the right here and we're gonna go down by four. So one, two, three, four, and then a diagonal. And then on the right, we're gonna go up by four. So we have one, two, three, four. That's gonna be the U. Now we're gonna space it out by one block. And then we're gonna have a row of five going down. One, two, three, four, five and then we're gonna have one block on the right on the second block from the top then we're gonna have a diagonal going down and a diagonal going up so we're left with this and then over here we need to have five so we're gonna just go one go to the top two go back to the bottom three four five and that's gonna be the m so here's the gum now we need the drop now we're gonna start working on the d so we're gonna place one space in block and then five black wools going down. One, two, three, four, five. With a black wool on the bottom and on the top. And then right here, we need to place three black wools. So one, two, three, whoops, a three, 
let's take a step back here we have gum now we need to do the ROP for gumdrop so we're gonna place two spacing blocks and then we're gonna place a row five one two three four five let's take out those two spacing blocks on the top we're gonna place just you know two diagonal blocks going down and to the right and then to the left and now we're gonna have two on the right going down and that's how you make an R now on the top here we're gonna place three spacing blocks and then a black wool then on each side we're gonna go down by three so one two three and then one two three and a block in the middle and that's gonna be the O. Now we're gonna work on this P, so we're gonna place two spacing blocks and then five black wools going down. One, two, three, four, five. And then we're gonna have, you know, just just three blocks like so, and that's how you build the P. So let me step back because here we have gumdrop buttons. Now we need to write not D on the top here. So we're gonna grab two spacing blocks over here. And we're gonna place just two spacing blocks. Then we're gonna grab our black wool and we're gonna place five black wools going up. So one, two, three, four, five. Then we're gonna add two diagonal black wools. Like so. And then on the right, we need to have five. So one, go to the top, two, three, go back to the bottom, four, five. And that's gonna be an N. Now we're gonna place two spacing blocks and a black wool. And on each side of this black, we're gonna go down by three black wools. So one, two, three. And then on the right, we're gonna go one, two, and three, and then one in the middle. And that's gonna be the O. So now we're gonna do the T. So we're gonna grab two spacing blocks, one, two, and then three black wools. Take out the two spacing blocks. And we're gonna place four black wools going down. One, two, three, and four. So that's gonna be the knot. Now we're gonna go find the D on gum drop. So here's the D. And on this block here, we're gonna place just one brown, or one spacing block, doesn't have to be brown, I'm just using brown for the spacing block. And then above it, we're gonna place four black wools, and then three across the top. Now we're gonna place one spacing block, and to the right, we're gonna go down by five black wools. So one, two, three, four, five, take out the spacing block, we're gonna place one black wool here in the middle. And on the right, we need to add another row of five. Now we're gonna add one space in block and we're gonna place five black wools going down. So one, two, three, four, five. Then on the top, we're gonna to have two black wools going to the right, take out the space in block. Then we're gonna have one in the middle and on the bottom, we're gonna have two going to the right and that's what the letters should look like. I'm just gonna hover here for a second before I go and fill in our gingerbread man with some brown wool. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that and I'll be right back. And that's what it should look like after a little gingerbread filled in. So that's how you build not the gumdrop buttons, inspired pixel art from Shrek. Now, if you guys enjoyed this pixel art tutorial, please make sure to hit that like button down below, subscribe if you haven't, go ahead and click that notification bell so you can be notified when we post a new video. And now I'm gonna go watch Shrek. So thank you so much for watching and we'll see you real soon in the next video.